Hello friends, so today I am going to discuss how can I use brackets in a very good manner with AM development. So I have in already installed brackets in my system and I can see that in the extension manager I have already installed AM bracket extension. So this screen takes too much time every time. I don't know why. So yeah, in the installed place, I can see that I have AM brackets extension. If you want to install it in your system, you can install from URL. You can drag zip over here. You can download it from GitHub and you can search AM here and you will just see uh, install option in the place of disable and remove and you just need to install it. So this is the small part which you can cover by yourself. So we can move forward with some very interesting features so i can go to the configuration so i can go to aem and go to project settings so there are some synchronization settings these synchronization settings are very important to tell the brackets about the server so i have installed the server url admin username i mean and password whatever the password is and automatically synchronize file system so this option is important in case of you want to synchronize brackets with aem so it just automatically send the content from brackets to AM server but it doesn't work vice versa and my favorite and most important button notification button my synchronized status button this button has four colors can have four colors like green blue red and yellow so I, I hope you don't want to see red at all so <laughs> red means that no synchronization of files uh, blue means in progress of synchronization green means yeah I'm done with synchronization and yellow means some are synchronized and some are not so let me go to my new password and uh, okay I am just going to a file new password and uh, I can add just some string over here like this is a demo so when I when I uh, click save you just uh, make a notify this button control s and it just gi uh, gives me color blue and then green it means it is getting synchronized and when i go over here and i just the page okay let me go down okay i can see that this is a demo so this is the fun of automatically synchronization so that's why i really like packets so you must be thinking that how to pull data from server to brackets and it means file system so how to do it so this is a demo it's, uh, import to brackets let's suppose let me write it wrong spelling okay no matter okay so i can go to my specific file new file and i can bring it over here import from server and now don't forget to refresh the file tray so yeah this is a demo import to brackets so yes it is here and uh, if you don't want an automatic synchronization you have a button over here export to server it can help you to send your content from brackets to uh, am server by by request it means when you want it okay so let's uh, find out some more options in the am i have two more options export content package to server import content package to server export content package uh, deploy all the content to the server and import does the reverse manner but uh, especially i don't recommend these steps because these takes too much time and i cannot wait idle for that much time so i uh, prefer preferably it is not recommended just push and pull small small content and it can help you in a better way so what other things i can do okay i just need to move it and okay div data slide hyphen so it gives me a lot of um, you know intelligence that tells me okay these all are attributes i can use and this helps me a lot in coding so i can have all the current page and resource and a lot of things so it is very good in terms of you know development as well so that's all am brackets have so my special recommendation for this particular tool so thank you